Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. I'm going to review some tortilla chips. This is called Two Gringos Chupacabra Tortilla Chips. This is the original. It says seasoned with two gringos chupacabra award-winning rubs and seasonings i've had i've had tortilla chips that have like a, a seasoning to i think julio's is one that's really really good and i think this is going to be similar to that um only much more cheaper than julio's because it's they were pretty expensive um <clears throat> so let's see what it says on the back here i'm going to read a little bit back here so if, you don't want to if you're not interested in that part you can fast forward um it says uh greetings <clears throat> from two gringos chupacabra llc we are serious purveyors of the finest seasonings salsas chips dry sausage jerky and mar marigate 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 it all started when the the gringo <laughs> created the original blend to boost his, his winnings on the barbecue circuit. Um, his winnings on the okay, fellow grill masters got a taste of this delectable concoction and verbally exclaimed, "This would make a this would make a dead chupacabra taste good." <laughs> the phrase stuck stuck, and that's how we become. That's how we became known as Two Gringos Chupacabra. We never take shortcuts when it comes to quality. This includes using only the finest ingredients available, and it shows. Whatever you choose to make with our award-winning products, we can guarantee it will be chupalicious. Chupalicioso. Okay, I'm just going to scan a little bit of the ingredients. Um, stone ground white corn, um, canola oil, a trace of lime. Uh, spices include salt, monosodium glutamate, spices, dehydrated garlic, sugar, brown sugar, dehydrated onion, paprika, chili peppers, um, brown sugar. Did I say brown sugar? Um, dehydrated bell peppers, red bell peppers, butter flavor, um, got some lemon powder, lemon oil, and that's about it. There's a lot of stuff in there. I don't have any scissors, so I, uh, I cleaned my hand with the, with the sanitizer wipe, and I cleaned my knife off, too, so... See if this blade is sharp enough to ooh, cut right through there. Oh my goodness. Man, those smell good. That that uh, yellow corn. Is it yellow corn? <clears throat> White corn. Man, that smells good. Here's one. Oh, excuse me. Here's one that's got a nice little red. It's kind of, it might be hard to see on the camera. It has a nice little powder coating of, of red seasoning there. A little bit more than some of the other ones that I've see in here hmm you get a little bit of a a little garlic a little onion you get the tortilla chip that smells really good oh gosh I'm sorry um you might get that trace of lime but it's very faint 
It might get more on the taste, I don't know. But it just said a trace, so that's kind of like a hint of hint of lime. Hmm. Wow. <coughs> That is really good. That is really good. That is really good. Crispy, crunchy, got a saltiness. You get that seasoning of a, of a garlic and onion. Um, a very light heat, heat coming on. Um, I'm not getting the flavor of the red of the red peppers. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Paprika. Yeah, a little bit. They are, I mean it's very, very lightly sweet. Um just kind of like a like a sweet corn kind of kind of sweetness, so it's not huge. Um, they do have a, like a little bit of an oil content to them. Um, I don't think I'm really getting a, a hint of a hint of lime or lemon. Let me see. No, not really. Not really. Um, they're really good. They're really good. If you see these, get the, get some, because these are these are a good quality tortilla chip. They give you a pretty good amount. I can't remember how much I paid for them. But I'm pretty sure it wasn't as much as Julio's are. Mm. <coughs> yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to end it there. Well, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Let me know if you've tried these. What you thought of them. Ooh. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> They're not consistently covered with stuff um some are some are going to be stronger tasting than others i just got one that had a lot of garlic and onion seasoning on it it was really really good um but it was just like a a big big flavor boost right there 
um, with heat too. The heat came on a little higher than what I would have been experiencing with the other ones. Um, yeah, I'm gonna hit just a little above medium. Just it's in the roof of my mouth, kind of kind of burning a little bit. Um, but it's mostly on the mild side. So if you don't like hot, you know, hot stuff, then th these you're gonna you'll be fine with these. So <clears throat> very good. Okay. Now I'm going to end it, and I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.